All right, kids, Tim here from High End Cheap Tech again, and today we're going to do an unboxing and initial impressions and kind of go over the, you know, ins and outs of this product. Yes, that is the, uh, I don't know if it's going to focus or not, we'll get it back by me here, uh, the Elector D10 wireless earbuds. And, uh, yeah, I know I've always said I don't like the idea of earbuds because they send the sound directly into your ears versus headphones, which are not quite so invasive, even though the sound can still damage your hearing. And I managed to get through my years in the Navy when I went in. They wanted me to be a sonar technician. They said, man, you, your hearing is so good. We've never had anybody do this well on a hearing test. And I was like, I want to work on airplanes. And they're like, such a waste. But to this day, at my age, bad heart, you know, and all the other stuff that goes along with being 60 years old. Uh, the one thing that still works really well are these things. So I take care of them. So I won't be testing them to max volume. Uh, I picked these up uh, for about... Uh, Twenty four ninety five, something like that, on Amazon through Prime. Got them in one day, and uh, we're, we'll see how good they are. So let's get right to the unboxing after the intro. Let's do that right now. And all links I mentioned will be in the description below, including a link to the phone we're filming on, the Mi A two the MPOW tripod we're using, and of course, the Elector D10 wireless earbuds. Let's do the intro. All right, folks. So here we are. We're going to do an unbox here on the Elector. They're D10 wireless earbuds. Oh, yeah. Pretty, pretty new for me to be doing these. Uh, Anti-dropout, mini size, one-step pairing, built-in microphone. And uh, what do we got here? It, up to eight hours talk time, up to four hours music time, up to 180 hours of standby time, and uh, 10 meters wireless range. Let's see what we get in the box. These were about 24 something on Amazon. That link will be in the description below as usual. We're just going to set that right back there and see what we got here. We've got our case. Which uses micro USB to charge. Looks fairly straightforward. Pops open. And inside it's nice and shiny. And we'll set those there. And then we're going to take out the earbuds themselves. Now I don't know if this is these are pre-charged from the factory or not. Uh, they aren't really labeled left and right, so Tim's going to have to just live and learn here. Uh, let's see. Well, that was the right one, so I'm guessing it's going to go right in there. I don't know. Bingo. We've got a little red light. Put a little LEDs on. And then we're going to drop this one in here. It's got, yeah, yeah, it's a fairly solid case. Let's see what else is in this box. Lots of foam. And deep down inside, we've got another box here, which I'm going to open up off camera. It's just easier that way. And we've got our warranty card. We've got a whole bunch of instructions. We 
which we'll try to follow. And so, uh, and what else do we have in the case here? We should have, oh, I don't know, bunches of, bunches and bunches, and even more bunches of tips. Let's check them out. See what we got. Besides the ones that come on it. We got us... Uh, All right, we got the, these type. We have these little short barrel ones. And two sets of those. And we have two more sets of these. Or Different. No, that's a, another short barrel. Oh, ah, that's kind of weird. I think we got more in the bag. Yeah, we haven't dumped them all out because Tim is an idiot. So let's get them all out. So we've got a grand total here of let's see, large bunches. Of these things, one, and two of those, two of those, four of those, and a bunch of different sizes here of these guys. Like three sets of these. And I believe it came with a set of the round ones back there. So once I figure out which ones who fit in my ear best. Would have been nice if I was pointed at the stuff when I was digging it out of the plastic. There's all the tips it comes with. There's our box. Uh, with the earbuds in it. And it has the larger ones already inside. Uh, looks like they're charging already. Now, as far as figuring out how charged up this thing is, I don't know how we do that. There may be a button somewhere. I'm not sure. Uh, oh, and of course, our micro USB cable for charging, which since I already have one plugged into the PC. Uh, well, we're gonna get this thing charged up, figure out which earbuds fit the best, and then we're gonna go through all the pairing up and how they sound. How does that sound to you folks? Sounds good to me. Uh, so far, it's a pretty nice little case. Yeah, it's got the micro USB, get over it. And it does have lights in the back. Uh, on either side, I believe, to indicate probably when it's fully charged. I'll learn these things when I read the instructions. RTFM, as we used to say in the Navy. So, I'm going to shut her off for now, and I'll be back probably in a few hours. Okay, folks, I'm back. Uh, I have the... Uh, uh, the Elector D10 earbuds in my ear right now. It took me a while to figure out how to pair them up. I had to read the instruction manual several times. You got to remember this is my first time with these. And uh, so I'm going to show you how quickly they connect. Let's check that out. We're using the new mobile G3 here. Let's check. We're going to turn this on, and connecting, shouldn't take long. There 
There we go. We are connected. Pretty quick. Not lightning fast or anything. And then I'll go into my uh, little app here. I play music on. And uh, it's, it's cranking. We are at, uh, I might be uh, yelling a bit loud. I'm only at half volume here. And uh, I can do a double click here in advance. Well, actually, I went backwards because I used the left one. I haven't quite got the buttons down yet. Uh, so, excuse me if I'm yelling, but what I can tell you is, that I can uh, pause them, and they uh, work very well. I can walk around the first floor of the apartment, and they work rather well here uh, this is not the final review or anything but what I will tell you is the way I, I, now I have an uh, equalizer set up on this puppy uh, in that uh, rocket player app that I use and I got you know bass boosted a little and I got treble and mid range is basically Right along the flat side. And I've only listened to them at half volume. I cranked them up once and damn near blew my eardrums out. These really, really sound great uh, for the price. Yeah, I am no audiophile, but what I will tell you is for the money. If you're looking for something inexpensive and uh, just something to shove in your ear so you can listen to music maybe at work or on the road or wherever you shouldn't be listening to it or maybe when you go to take a nap like I'll probably do here in an hour or so. Uh, They work great. And the case is quite solid. Snaps shut nicely. And these LEDs at the back on either side turn steady blue once she's fully charged up. Uh, I don't have any play times. This is an initial review, folks. Obviously. Uh, initial impressions. But, uh, I would say, right, as a, as far as I'm concerned, right now, buy these. They're actually, I think it's twenty four sixty four over on Amazon. The links will all be in the description below. Make sure to give us a like. Subscribe to the channel. If you like videos like this, share them with everyone you know. And I'll catch you with a full review in a couple of days after I've read the rest of the owner's manual. Because it took me a while to get these paired. They pair to the left side, which is kind of weird. But you can use either one or one or the other. And uh, they work great. And they have clicky buttons. And uh, I had to use the absolute smallest uh, ear piece ends. Uh, and they are a royal pain to get on and off these headphones. I had to literally kind of fold it back and hold it and then... You know, put a little spit on my finger and wrap it, you know, do something around the the nozzle, whatever you want to call it, and kind of work it in there, and eventually, whoop, they went in. 
Uh, I'm going to try the little square ones. You know, the really short ones that came with also. See if those do any better for me. Uh, it's going to be a meddler. Matter of personal preference. I've had these in for a good uh, hour now. Listening to tunes. Playing around. Uh, I like them. I would have to recommend these as a budget uh, set of earbuds. And uh, a pretty damn good one. So those reviews on Amazon were pretty much spot on. The bass is fantastic. Uh, now, I don't listen to hip hop. But I did listen to some, you know, I like my trebles too. I listened to some Triumph, you know, 1970s music and some 19, well, some Sammy Hager, and man, they sounded good. And some orchestra music from Tchaikovsky, 1812 Overture, the boom from the cannons was good too. So, that's all I have for tonight. So, thanks for watching, and... Remember, thumbs up, subscribe, hit the little bell. We'll catch you in the next one, probably tomorrow, but it won't be the reveal of these. We'll have something else. It's going to take a few days to play around with these. Later, folks.